So in this video, I want to start talking about the cycloalkanes. Many organic compounds are cyclic. It means that they contain rings of atoms. It can be one ring or it can be more than one ring. The carbohydrates, for example, we, the carbohydrates we eat are cyclic. The antibiotics we use to treat diseases are cyclic as well. So basically we have, um, I put some of these cycloalkanes here, like uh, cyclopropane, which it contains three carbon atoms, cyclobutane, it contains four carbon atoms, cyclopentane, it contains five carbon atoms, cyclohexane, it contains six carbon atoms, and cycloheptane, it contains seven atoms. As you see here, the number of hydrogen atoms is two times bigger than the number of carbon atoms. So for example, if you have C3H6 or C4H8, C5H10, C6, H12, and C7, H14. And the rest of the hydrocarbons is going to be like that, the rest of the cycloalkanes. Cycloalkanes are alkanes that contain rings of carbon atoms. Simple cycloalkanes are named like a cyclic, it means a non cyclic alkanes, with the prefix cyclo, indicating the presence of a ring. For example, the cycloalkane with four carbon atoms in the ring is called cyclobutane. And the cycloalkane with seven carbon atoms in the ring is called cycloheptane. So basically, that's the basis of cycloal uh, cycloalkanes. 